morning. Here we are at uh, down Galveston area fishing uh, Chocolate Bayou. Started out the morning uh, it was about 34 degrees in uh, in Katy. Got a little warm as got down towards the coast, but still pretty brisk this morning. Turning out to be a beautiful day. I would say at this point there is absolutely no wind. We've seen some bait. I uh, haven't been uh, very lucky at finding any fish yet though. Uh, but uh, fishing today with Scott. Here's Scott, Captain Scott. Anyway, we'll uh, continue on, see if we can find him. Little view of uh, the bayou coming up from Chocolate Bay. As you can see, really glassy. Water's kind of murky. I'd say visibility is probably a foot, if that. But hopefully, when we head out towards the intercoastal, uh, look a little bit better. Well, been pretty slow fishing, but what a beautiful day. Looks like uh, Lake Galveston out here. It's hardly a ripple on the water. And here's Scott. I think he's throwing a top water. Top dog, junior That's, black with orange belly. He's throwing a hot dog, whatever they call it. There, just about to cook me in the head. <laughs> nice cast. See him catch a fish here with it. Waiting for that big blow up. Well, it looks like we might be taking the trip to HEB on the way home. I don't think we got enough money to pay a fish to bite. Alrighty, well, we'll come back. We're going to change locations here in a little bit and uh, give it one more last go. But uh, I don't know if you can see it there, but I'm looking straight out across the Galveston West Bay towards San Luis Pass. A little sailboat coming up on us here. Okay. Ooh, I can feel that one go whizzing by my ear. Things you gotta be careful on the intercoastal. Well, it wasn't the best day to be out fishing today uh, with bluebird skies, high pressure, a uh, little bit of water movement. Uh, just wasn't conducive to catching fish, not a lot of bait either. But uh, we did do a lot of exploring found uh, a lot of new spots in the Chocolate Bayou area uh, and Chocolate Bay uh, that I think will be excellent spots with some drop-offs, oyster reefs, some marsh areas uh, that'll be uh, 
very productive, I think, another day. But uh, until we get back there, uh, tight lines, thanks a lot.